Want to find one seventh of 56, just divide 56 by 7, and that's 8. I've got to write 35 to 50 as a ratio in its simplest form. So that means I can divide what kind of goes into both of these. Well, 5 goes into both. So I'll divide that side one by 5 and that one by 5, and that gives me 7. And 50 divided by 5 is 10. And nothing goes into uh, 7 and 10, well, apart from 1. And that will still leave it at 7 to 10. Right, 8 millimetres to 12 cent centimetres as a ratio in its simplest form. 12 centimetres. I need to get them in both in the same unit. I could put the 8 millimetres to 0 0.8 centimetres, but better to turn the centimetres into millimetres. That would be 120 millimetres. And now it's much, much easier. That's 8 to 120. And divide both by 2. And that will be 4 to 60. Well, that'll be divide by 2 again, which will be 2 to 30. Still divide by 2, 1 to 15. And then that's as low as it can go. So 1 to 15. I could, if I'd seen it and realized that I could have divided right away to start by 8 and divide by 8, if you'd seen that, or divide by 4 to get to the 2 and divide that by 4 to get to the 30. Don't have to just keep on dividing by two and always check that the three doesn't go into it as well. But in this case, it doesn't. And that's two done.